And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from Serie A. It's Inter, and they take on Cremonese. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And this is how it looks for Inter. Samir Handanovic begins in goal. Milan Skriniar plays alongside Alessandro Bastoni in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And in attack, Romelu Lukaku starts alongside Lautaro Martinez. A look at the opposition starting lineup today. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated, and it could be difficult for them. And the match begins. Really well played pass. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Chalanolu. Romelu Lukaku now. Lukaku. Well, he gave it quite the blast, but nowhere close to the goal. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Well, he had to read it and get there, and did. This looks threatening. A wonderful intervention. Martinez. It's with Robin Gosens. And a goal it is! No long wait for the opener today. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it. But the finish is far too easy. He doesn't even have to jump. How has he afforded that much space? It's a tidy header, but really poor defending. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Romero, 
Bartolome on the ball Dessers definitely look as though they want to make this move count asking a lot to score from there goalkeeper's ball this attack looks highly promising and he favours the inside route oh a tremendous block De Frey. Barella has it. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Can they keep it going? Well, it was a brilliant break, but no goal as a result. Well, forget the finish and just admire the way they counter attack there. They did it with such pace and quality. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Well, possibilities in the centre. And he takes on the shot. In it goes! Delighted to be two in front. Things look good for them now. Well, here's the replay. And just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Let's see if something comes of this. But the flag is raised, and that brings this move to an end. Well, he saw the pass, but he just couldn't get it away quickly enough. Well, Inter have certainly controlled the flow of the game, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Bartolome. Now, let's see what they can do here. But well, nothing comes of it. Dumfries Chalanolu on the ball Bastoni Skriniar Martinez can he finish and close down straight away Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Oh, he looks threatening. Lukaku! Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. But I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it should go in at that near post. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. Well, Romelu Lukaku, a player who can finish with the very best of them and proving to be such a difficult opponent of this game, Stuart. Well, he's looked unstoppable today. Quick, clever, skillful, and he's taken his goals really well. He's been wonderful to watch. And the game begins. So the ball is moving again, and it was a delightful performance from Inter in the first half of this match.
Lukaku. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Now well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Michele Castagnetti. Not a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Loves to attack from the wide areas. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Tremendous block. Barella. The ball with Martinez. Chalhanolu. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Bartolome. Barella. Romelu Lukaku now. Now options are plenty. Now shot happy here. Body in the way. Bartolome. Juan Nauto. An interceptor there. Unable to keep the ball. Dessers. Now can they counter clinically? Well, it wasn't the best piece of finishing in all honesty. Goal kick. Yeah, it was all good until that final effort. Just shows you how devastating they can be on the break, though. Just 15 minutes remaining. Dessers deserves credit for winning the ball back. Martinez. Barella has it. Terrific piece of anticipation. Dessers. Couldn't hang on to it again. Well, in the closing phase, and Inter really have seen everything go to plan for them in this match. Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think. Oh, wait a minute, Stuart. Opportunity. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, as you can see from the replay, it's the perfect through ball from Lautaro, and Lukaku does the rest. He hits through the back of the ball with such power, it's a great finish. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Barella, Lukaku. Not a huge chunk of added time, one minute. Might be a chance here. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him.
And that will do it. The referee's whistle means it is officially final. Inter get the victory and the three points. The fans are going to be happy with this. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest.